Well, how do the chums? I'm back inside of Starfield, and I'm gonna go and visit Planet Gargan. Yes, it is a planet, not a moon this time, people. So let's go and lock on in Planet Gargan. Okay, it's unavailable to scan right now because we're not close. Let's put down a marker. Well, we're gonna have to travel there first, people. Okay, well, it looks like it's gonna have fauna and flora and four resources. So let's go travel to Planet Gargan. You are entering United Colony space. Yeah, Please I know. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. All right, go for it. Sweet. Done. Scan complete. You're clear to land at Gagarin. You sound like you're really enjoying your job there, my friend. Let's go into here then. Let's uh, scan this planet then. Let's move around to the light side of the planet. There we go. Because once you're in this mode, it's hard to tell whether it's night or day. Right, so we're looking for a biome. Let's see what we've got there. Wetlands. Okay, we'll go to the wetlands first then, people. Let's go there. Who cares? With one of my lovely Pictiors. Pictiors, that's planet Crete, if memory serves. I guess what a beautiful planet that is, in its own way. In the way a mother could only love, I suppose. If planets had mothers, which they don't. So I don't know what I'm talking about. Well, they could. Who knows what the Big Bang was. Yeah. Oh, anyway, we've arrived. Ooh! Sweet! I see some floating octopi creatures as soon as we arrive. That's, um, that's a wondrous treat for the eyeballs, isn't it? I guess it is. Okay, let's get those scanned, Sarah. Yeah, I'm with Sarah Morgan today, people. We scan all of these. Are, are they, um, are they dangerous? So, what have we got? Vegetable or mineral? Uh, good question, Sarah. I don't know. Sarah Morgan, she's um, she's usually good at this stuff, but I would say these are fauna because they're coming up as being as such. I don't know what they're congregating onto, though. Oh, look, there's other wildlife here. Oh, what are you? Little scuttle bugs. Get these. Holy fudge, there's a lot of life here. They're a little bit too far away. We'll worry about those in a moment. We're going to continue scanning these guys for now. Where'd they all go? All right, well, we've got loads of flora here, too. Got all sorts going on on this blinking planet. Look how much blue stuff there is. Okay, I don't know where all of his mates went. Let's shoot him. What resource do you give? Why are you not dying? Oh, now you are. Right, we killed it. Let's um, pick that up. 10 XP. It's not a great deal of XP, is it? I mean, let's face it. Anyway, let's go into our skills, because I didn't see that bar appear. You know, when you murdercate something. Well, this one over here. Okay, so we are. Let's uh, move into there. Boom. Why can't I um, unlock that yet? Complete the previous... Oh, okay. We haven't done that one. All right, fine. Well, we might as well do the um, flora as well. We might as well stick that into flora too, by the way. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay. I've done rank one. Why can't I do rank... Surely. Harvest 20 organic... Re okay, we're still doing that then, people. What about the rocks then? I'll put that into there. There we are. Getting very sciencey now, people. Is that the same as the parrot hawk that we saw on previous planet? I don't know. We're going to have a better look in a moment, people. Oh, he's just... What the... Why is he frozen? What the freaking heck just happened to this guy? Oh, it's a sea bat. We have seen sea bats before, but this guy's quite big. I'm going to get a picture of him while he's so still. Oh, that's going to be a lovely photograph. A nice picture of a sea bat. Heck yes! Thank you for um, obliging for my photographies. Well, we've got lots of plants to scan here. That one's quite cool. There's another sea bat there. Another sea bat. Oh, look, there's lots of scuttlebugs here. I call them scuttlebugs. I'm just making up names as we go along, people. It's an APAC Dust Devil Exo Runner. Well, that's a mouthful, isn't it? Okay, we've 100% scanned those things. The Coral Bucket Filter. 
Interesting. Well, we might as well head towards this point of interest over yonder hill. Life signs. This planet is just teeming with things to scan, isn't it, people? I'm just going mental here. Getting all sorts. Oh, what are you? Lead. Okay, cool. That's a very small rock, that lead. Oh, my days. These guys look freaking cool. Hello. Look at them. Oh, they're gnarly, aren't they? I like them. You can get a picture of them. All right. Hmm. They don't seem to mind me. Oh, yes, they do. Mates! Why? Why? Why, why even try? Okay, we get 26 XP off of these guys. You know what? I'm getting quite a lot of XP murdering creatures. And I've got quite a lot of bullets. In fact, I could just use my freaking mining tool. But, you know, they don't really fight back. Like pirates and spacers and all the other sorts of stuff, you know? What's to stop me from just going to a planet like this that's got so much life on it and extinguishing all the life and getting myself a freaking shed ton of XP? There's nothing, is there? There's nothing to stop me from doing that. Oh, we need to harvest plants. There we are. And I need to harvest 20 different plants. Okay, there's a scuttlebug over there that I haven't scanned. Oh, I don't, I don't think I've harvested this type of plant either. Let's harvest that. Oh my days. They're murdering each other, people. Let's scan this guy. Scanned. We've got another resource there as well. Jesus Christ. There's, there's a lot to scan on these planets, isn't there? That's quite a gnarly bug. Let's have a better looking camera mode at this guy. Holy mackerel. What a strange creature. That is proper strange, isn't it? I mean, we've got strangeness in our own o oceans. I mean, let's face it. We've got some really gnarly alien looking creatures in our own oceans. Uh, which is another thing about this game. I know that we can swim, but we can't dive. I kind of feel they've missed a bit of a trick there. You know, they could add in a new biome. Maybe that'd be an, a, a DLC, you know? Under rare wells or water planets. Yeah, that'd be quite cool, wouldn't it? I don't know how they'd populate them into the universe. I mean, they could just spawn extra planets into each system, I suppose. Or they could take the gas giants and turn some of those into water planets or something, couldn't they? You know? Who knows? Anyway, I digress. We've reached one of our points of interest. Let's get some of this scanned. There we go. 100% servicated that one. Oh, there's only one point of interest to be found on this planet by those of things, and I think we've just done that. Okay, well, there's still a lot of fauna inside of these areas that I haven't completely scanned -icated, like this guy over here. Oh, no! This is a Terramorph. Okay, well, he's not scannable. We better put this away. We better get out our weapon. I don't know how these Terramorphs are getting all over the universe, but they freaking are. Here it comes. Yeah, I missed it. Sarah, what was that? That was miles away. Ow! Wow! I don't get a bonus for ducking then. All right, reload. Let's do this. Go, Sarah. Yeah, you punch it. I'm not a good shot. Has to be said. Bring it on. She's just going toe to toe with this thing. She's just punching it in the face. Go, Sarah. Go. I have given her a weapon, but she she just Bruce Lee's it, you know. Might as well take what we can. I did. Okay, epic music has now ended. Oh, that was pretty epic, wasn't it? You know. Right. Well, um, we've gone to the point of interest. I suppose we could sort of walk back to the ship and just hope that we scan some stuff on the way back there. 
I mean, yeah, I mean, hold on. We've got some blues over there. I can see some blue. And there's some more blue over there. We go to each of those. Well, what are these little guys? I don't think I've scanned any of these. What are they? Probably rocks, Steve. No, they're not. They're li these little beetle things. Oh, okay. We've seen these on planet Crete, haven't we? Let's um, let's just get a picture of them before they scuttle away. Hello, little guys. Chikapow! We've got a lot of these uh, sea bats. I do like the sea bats. They do look quite cool, don't they? Yeah. Right. Well... There were sea bats in planet Jemison, but you know, if, if there's planets quite close to each other in the same system, you, you kind of accept that as being possible in the realm, realms of, you know, travel and whatnot. So we've got all them. Ah, there's a predator over here. Let's go get that predator scanned. Okay, let's go murder a few things. Little bit of murder didn't hurt anyone. That does not make sense, does it? But oh, okay. Ow. Punch and heck. I'm getting hurt. Ow. Fudge off, mate. Okay, if I am going to do that idea of XP, I, I, I might want to uh, consider better weapons or better strategies other than just running at them. Sarah, you need to get better with your throws. Yeah? Oh, shite. I've got no medipacks. Okay, right. Okay, this is, this is a bit of a problem, isn't it? I should have bought some while I was in Jemison. We'll go back there after this episode and get some. Right, it looks like I'm I'm bleeding or something. So let oh we'll eat that sandwich. Might give us a bit of health back. Um, anything else I can have to stop this bleeding? Where's the bandages? I've got some in here somewhere. I bought them all when I was in the freaking you know medical facility. Oh fudge. Okay, maybe I don't then. Trauma pack. There we are. Caribbean classic. Might as well have it. Oh, it's Terra Brew! Heck yes! Lovely. We'd have the turkey meat as well. And we'd have some of that. Hopefully that's that's put me back into tippity-top shape. No, it hasn't. It really hasn't, has it? And, uh, yeah. Puncture wounds. I'm still bloody bleeding. I, I'm sure I bought some. That's just freaking annoying. Maybe I went and chucked it away somewhere, but, um, yeah. I did have some there that uh, helped bleeding, but I guess not. Dang it! Yeah, we're we're in. Hmm, burns. No, no, we definitely got nothing for ble bleeding. I, I would have seen it. All right, fine. Uh, okay, we're taking damage still because of the bleeding, essentially. Oh well. Now look, there's something blue over there. It's probably a nasty creature that's going to cause me more bleeding, though. I could do with getting back to my ship and having a bit of a rest, to be honest. But, you know, while there's still blue stuff to scan, my mission is not completed. Let's scan him. Scan this guy. There's another blue one just over here. I can see my ship now. We're in close proximity, so... Ah, oh, fudging heck! I hate it when the view does that, because it throws you for a freaking loop. And I don't know why it does that. It just freaking does it whenever it feels like it. Okay. Let's head on over here, then. Done that a few times, people, hasn't it? You know? You've seen it live. Well, I say live. It's, it's kind of not live, is it? You know? Look, it done it again! It wasn't me. Did nothing. I think it's if you land on a rock or something because you're as you're jumping. I don't know. Right, we've got that one as well. Is that dead? Can I loot that? There we go. All right, cool. Well, there are other biomes, and they might share the same creatures and stuff like that. We might come across some new creatures. Who knows? 
Then we've got all the resources. Okay, I wasn't paying much attention. Let's get back on my ship. I'm going to rest for a bit. I'm going to chuck a few things into storage if I can. Let's get in before something else bites me. Yeah. Yeah, right, so here we go. I can do a little bit more research now because I've got the adaptive frame, so I might as well get that in there. Well, I haven't got enough iron. Yeah, that's crazy. All right, and there's a few bits and bobs that I haven't got enough for, but I'm just, just showing you that in between doing stuff, I am sort of plowing things into other places as well. One, it helps with inventory, doesn't it? You know? And two, helps with other stuff. So, slowly making progress. I haven't got no ornaments. All right. Horticultural, adaptive frame. I'm going to run out of adaptive frame soon, aren't I? Yeah, there we go. There we are, peeps. It just means I'm allocating stuff out and making a bit of free space in my old storage. Okay, so we went to wetlands last time. Let's go to the rocky desert this time and see what we find there, people. Okay, well, we've arrived, Kated. And yeah, th this almost looks this like a different planet. The colony looks more rundown than Ebside or Neon. And that's saying something. Haven't been to Ebside or Neon yet. We'd have to go and look at that, Sarah. But thanks for the heads up. Right, let's start scanning stuff yet again. So we've got another plant over here. Let's go and have a quick look at that. I'm probably still bleeding, aren't I? Yeah. I had a horrendous puncture wound, apparently. All right, well, we're going to we'll go pick this one up. I'm getting out of breath rather quickly. I did offload a load of stuff, but, you know... Who knows? It says that I'm still over encumbered. Oh, that was that was worthwhile then, wasn't it? What can I offload to Sarah then? All right, let's um, let's do that. Okay, chums. Well, I'm back at it, and I'm scanning quite a lot of blues. You can see there's some more over in yonder distance. Ah, the camera mode went freaking weird again. Don't know what happened there. Keeps doing it. Don't know why. Okay, right. Where that blue? Where did the blues go? Aha, there they are. I think. Right, yeah, so there's this plant here, which looks quite reminiscent of others I've seen already, but we've got that scanned. I've already plucked that plant too, and that one. So yeah, making good progress on these old plants. Hopefully we get the flora totally scanned soon. We're doing quite good on fauna. It's the little guys, the little the little sort of buggy beetly ones that I've got to find more of. They seem to be quite rare, even in this area. And I come across a new sort of cactus. It's like this ball cactus plant. I thought I was recording, but I hadn't hit record. So, yeah, a little bit of footage missing, but it doesn't matter because we've got to scan more. I'm liking this sort of structure of rock here. That's pretty darn gnarly, isn't it? Just to come across that in the wild, that's pretty darn cool. You know what? That looks quite unique. Let's get a photo of that. Looks like the sun is setting on this beautiful day. I wonder if I can just um, add in some sort of filter, just to sort of, yeah, brighten it up a bit. There we go. That looks pretty epic. Lovely. I like that. Okay, right. It is moments like that that I really enjoy about this game, you know? Okay. Well, we've got all the resources. I just need to find more of these cactus plants. Aha, there's another one of those little critters that I've got to find. There he is. I haven't managed to scan him. He ducked behind this rock before I could get him. 100% done. Nice. Okay, right. The fauna in this area, apparently I've catalogued it all. But I'm still looking for more of these cactus plants. Ah, dang. It's a shame I wasn't recording, because then you would have seen the cactus plant. But it's, it's like a bull cactus. Hopefully I'll see another one. Okay, chums, I think this might be one. Yes, that's the thing. So I need to find more of them. And they're freaking rare as. I don't know whether they're more abundant in another biome or something. Or whether I've just walked into another biome where I am right now. So if I carry on looking... Ah, there's one over there. Sneaky. Or is that a different plant that I just need to scan more of? Let's go and have a look-see. Okay, yeah, there's another plant that I need to scan. Well, we 100 percented that one. Level 16. But I, I... Yeah, I'm going to wait till the epic music ends before I say anything. 
So I'm looking for more of those cacti. Now, I took a picture next to a rock just like this earlier. We'll come across another one. So, yeah, it's, it is what it is. Geological type anomalies. You know what? I might chance go into another biome and we'll come back to this biome if I can't find any more of these cactuses anywhere else because they shouldn't be this rare. I mean, look, I've been walking for swathes of landscape and not seen another one of those little cactusy guys. And I've tried to stay at the same sort of elevation. Because that's something I've noticed. A lot of the biomes are to do with, like, elevation and stuff like that. Some wind turbines up here. I'm just going to take a quick look up here. If I don't see one up here, I think I might try another biome. What the fudge is that sound? I don't like that sound. What was that? Okay. Something and nothing then. I just saw a load of red stuff fly. Look, oh, look, they're shooting. Oh, okay. I don't know what they're shooting at, but they are shooting. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I might fast travel somewhere else. And if I have to come back here, I have to come back here. So yeah, that was rocky desert that we was in, people. Let's let's try over here. So there's water over here, wetlands. We've already done 100% on wetlands. Rocky desert over there. I need to go to the light side of the planet, though. Let's try somewhere that's got a little bit of mixed. It still says rocky desert. Is there any other biomes here? Wetlands and rocky desert. Is that pretty much it? I think it is. All right. Well, what's this, then? Rocky desert. Okay. Let's try going there, then. Rocky desert in the daytime let's go there now i'm not too sure what the missing fauna is if there is still missing fauna i know the plants that i need but i'm not too sure on the fauna there's there's still two fauna that i haven't found or 100 percent scanned how odd all right well we carry on looking anyway people okay I don't really like heading to structures on planets where there's a lot going on. Is there any sort of... Mm, uh, they're all structures around here. Alright, well, we'll just carry on this way then. Sarah's killing stuff. She likes killing stuff, does Sarah. I don't mind her killing stuff. It just ten changes the tempo a bit, though, doesn't it? Anyway, I'll let you know if I come across anything blue. Okay, chums, there's something blue over in the distance, over here. Let's have a look what it is. I think it's a cacti. So we might be lucky. Maybe there's more cactuses around here. Yes, it's a cactus. Boom, we've got a cactus. Any other cactuses in nearby vicinity of this cactus? If you are, please stand up. Yeah, that's not going to happen, Captain Steve. It's not going to happen. All right, okay, well, I'll carry on then. We'll see if we find anything other than cactuses that are blue. Yeah, the fauna is a bit of a myth. Okay, there's something really weird going on, people, that I have to show you. I'm being attacked by something that's invisible. I'm getting hurt. Look, my energy's just going down all the freaking time. I don't know what it is. I'm going to run back to my ship before I freaking die because it's invisible. I can't see it. Okay, now this is really weird, chums. It's saying that I'm still in combat even though I'm in my ship. Okay? And look, it, it won't let me fast travel anywhere because it says that I'm still in combat. Look. Can't come, but bummer. Can't, can't, can't go there because you're still in combat. What the fudge do I do? I might just have to turn the whole game off. Hold on, the music's just changed now. Maybe it's registering that I'm not in combat anymore. Let's just hope that's the case. Right, let's spin it around here. Bring up the resources. No, still says that I'm in combat. I'm in combat, people. Apparently, can't fast travel. I'm going to turn the game off and come back in again. This is just freaking weird. The only thing is I don't know when it last saved. Let's go all the way out. Let's see if we can do a quick save. I can. Hopefully it's not going to come back to say that I'm in freaking game or whatever. But yeah, I'm going to come, come out of the whole freaking game, I guess. I'm going to turn off the whole console. I'm back in game, and it says that I'm still in combat. Um... Right, well, I guess the only other thing to do is to stand outside until I die. I think, what would you... This is just 
What the fudge is attacking me? There's there's nothing out there. Look. Hold on. Okay, let's let's see what Sarah's shooting, shall we? So she's just firing into nothingness. Okay, we've got this weird winged bat thing. Is this it? Is this what's causing me the trouble? And it was hitting me from miles away somehow. I have no idea. Let's let's use the fracking gun. All right. No, gun. Okay. What is she shooting now? Okay. Right, we just murder everything then. New plan. But you, mate. Yeah, see, now I'm getting hit by something that I can't see. What's actually hitting me? Okay, are we good? Are we now not in combat? Nope, she's found something else to kill. You've got nothing, nothing. Yeah, you tell him, Sarah. I honestly don't think he's in combat with us. You know, there we are. I'm nearly out of ammo now. We better not be in combat anymore. Right, let's see if we can fast travel out of this freaking hellhole, shall we? Right, let's go around this side. And I want to travel near to the water if I can. You can't land during combat. We're, we're stuck. We're stuck here, people, forever. I, I can't see anything that I'm in combat with. Okay. Am I in combat with that? I am now. I wasn't, though. Great amount of weapons. Oh, amount of bullets on that thing. Got no bullets on that one. No bullets on that one. Got a couple on this. Come on. I don't get it, though. We, we, we shouldn't even be in combat. This is... This is weird. Look, well, I'm miles away from the dang thing. I can't even hit it. I don't think we're in combat with these. Come on, Sarah. Let's go over here. Let them come to us if we're in combat with them. Okay, well, she got that one. Get him, Sarah. Get him. All right. Let's try crouching. Let's let's go under cover. Let's see if we can go hide somewhere. Let's see if we can get out of combat by hiding. Uh, I have no idea why it's saying we're in combat right now. No idea at all. Come on, Sarah. Duck. Stealth mode. Stealth mode, Sarah. Stealth mode. Come on. Duck. Freaking duck! Ah, next time. Yeah, next time. Right, now I don't know whether these red markers mean that we're in combat. I mean, the, the radial shows that we're, we're in combat, I guess. Great. Well, what do we do? Do we go to some kind of outpost or something? Aha! I think we're out of combat now. Nope, we're not. I don't think we are. Or well, we were for a moment, I guess. I don't know. Cannot fast travel while you're in freaking combat! Okay, duck again. Right. Is there any bushes or foliage that we can get ourselves into? Come on, Sarah. Let's see if um, ducking in this bush helps. Right. There we go. Am I concealed?
Don't know whether this is going to work with airborne creatures. All right. So if that goes out of there, are we good now? No, nope, it's still red. I have no freaking idea, people. Right, I'm going to unlock freaking stealth. Let's see if this works then. Right, we're still in danger. From what exactly? For fudge sake. There's those bloody little pterodactylians that they're freaking useless. What am I in danger from exactly? I mean, it's not attacking, it's not doing anything. I'm just going to crouch here forever then. Okay, fun times. Hmm. I'm not too sure what we do, Sarah Morgan. You got any ideas, Sarah Morgan? Oh, here we go. What's going on now? Again. Sarah! Ah, oh, for fudge sake. Alright. Fine. The only thing is, you, you, you kill them, and more just spawn in. Is it just me, or I can't hit them for frickin' toffee? Yeah. I'll be back with you when I work this out. Okay, this stealth meter has helped, actually. Look, it's got it's going down to caution now. If I stay here, hopefully we'll be out of freaking combat very soon, people. All right, okay. So, yeah, I had to unlock the stealth skill, and now I'm hidden. So hopefully we're not in combat anymore. Hopefully we can now travel to another part of the blinking planet using fast travel. But, yeah, that was not fun. Can't fast travel during comp. You're having a... Freaking laugh! I'm not in combat! I'm not in combat. I'm hidden. I'm freaking not in combat anymore. I mean, it's still showing that there's a load of these freaking flying sea bats over that way. So if I head this way... Come on, back around this rock, Sarah. Come on. Let's just get away from these blasted things. Detected. By what? Okay, there's some more sea bats there. Okay, look, I'm hidden now. I'm not in combat. I'm not in combat. Okay. Oh my god, this is freaking a pain in the ass. Detected. Caution. Detect hidden. I'm freaking hidden now. Okay, how long do I have to stay hidden for before this freaking cools down? Oh god, it's gone back to detected again now. This is mental. Okay, I just started running towards a structure, and for whatever reason it's now letting me go, so I'm just going to freaking go anywhere. And just get out of this point, because I don't know what was attacking me, I don't know what was going on. Okay, well I've just arrived at this random point, and it looks like there's a load of creatures just sitting out here that I haven't scanned. There's, I'm fairly sure I have fully scanned these. I don't know why they're showing blue. Yeah, I, I knew I had. All right, okay. Um, this game seems to be bugging out on me, like, massively at the moment, people. Right, well, if I find any other blues that are actual real blues, I'll be sure to let you know. Yeah, probably... I'm still looking for the cactuses just to get the fauna done. I mean, the flora. But, yeah, we'll see how we get on with that. In fact, now that I'm... I, I can actually choose a place I want to go sensibly. Let's choose somewhere else on this map. Let's spin this around here. Now, I think this is ocean. No, it's not. Is that ocean, then? Nope. What about this, then? There's no water on this planet, is there? Okay. Let's try and go somewhere where there's like it looks like a mixed load of colour. Rocky desert. We go around there, then. Let's go there. Let's see what we find there. Yeah, chums, I think I've spotted another cacti. Yes, I have. There we go. Let's get that one done. Right, so that's 57%, so we need a few more of them. They are extremely freaking rare. Hmm. I'd like to have hoped that there, where there's one, there'd be others, you know? But it's not the case. There's another one! I guess! Nice! Scanned. Any others? Nearby? No. No others nearby. Okay, well, I carry on searching for more cacti, but uh, yeah, this is turning into a hunt for cactuses, people. It really is. 
We've got a ship landing, people. And this one looks like a big one. I'm going to try and nick it. Come on, Sarah. We've got a ship to steal. Oh, wow. This is pretty darn freaking epic. I want this ship. Right, this time I'm going on board so it can't take off. Freaking have it. Have it. Have it. I have it. Freaking have it. And the others? No? You're all good? What's that gun? It's our Grendel. Okay. I need need some ammo, Set so let's just anything useful and just leave the rest. Yeah, I, I I'm I'm with you on that now. I used to take everything. Space Adept Rip Shank. Okay, don't really need that, I guess. Synthetic ham. Don't really need that. Okay, right, we're on we're on the ship. Let's not let it take off. Let's put this away then. In it inaccessible, I can't nick the ship. Dang it! I wanted that ship. Oh well. Some you win, some you lose. Right, back to looking for cacti. Well, chums, because I'm not too sure what the missing fauna is, I've got a cave over in yonder. I'm going to go in a cave, just in case there might be a creature that lives in caves on this planet, because we're still too fauna short, and, you know, I've not seen any blues when it comes to fauna, so there must be something that I have yet to have discovered. I might go back to the wetlands as well in a bit and take another gander there, but... I think I'm doing okay on this desert mountainous rocky area. I just need to get the cacti done in this biome. Okay, I've literally been walking for a while. I'm a bit close to the cave now, but look, there's there's another cacti there. It looks like I only need one more cactus. It's okay, mate. I'm not going to attack you if you don't attack me. Okay? I'll give you a bit of a wide berth there, sir. Respect to the tiger monster. Any cactuses down there? No. Okay, well, we're getting quite close to this cave. 100 odd views. Looks like I've got to do a bit of climbing to get there, though, people. Okay, well, we've arrived located at the cave. Let's see if my suspicions might be correct. I mean, there's, there's a couple of dead creatures inside of here. Maybe something came in and killed them. Or they're asleep, one or the other. Oh, there's a chest there. Let's get that. Credits. Isotopic coolant. Okay, don't know what isotopic coolant is when it's at home. Hold on, is there another one? No, that's one we just looted. Okay. Not seeing any other creatures inside of here apart from these dead ones. That's the same storage box that I've already got. Let's head down here. Okay, we're deeper into the cave now. These ones are still dead, though. I'm not seeing anything inside of here. I hope there's not a big, horrible monster-type creature inside of here. And if there was one inside of these caves, it could be that we've got to go to a load of caves to find them. So I'm kind of hoping... That there's not something in here? At the same time hoping that there was? You know? Oh well, let's get out of here. No. So, although there's fauna inside of this cave, there's nothing new. Nothing new there, people. Well, I've decided to head to a point of interest anyway. Just see if there's anything interesting here to scan. Okay. And um, we've got dung piles. Lone Hills. Location discovered. Again. I don't see much to scan here that I haven't already scanned. Let's get out of this, though, because I'm freaking standing in some sort of toxic sludge there. You can hear the beep, 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 beep. beep. That's a sign that you're somewhere where you shouldn't be. There's nothing there to scan that's new, is there? There is a dung pile over here. Let's go and investigate the dung pile. 
Okay. Sorry, mate. I know that I'm in your territory. Let's get out of here, then. Okay, so there really isn't much. Uh, I need to find that last remaining cactus. Aha! The last remaining cactus! That was worth going there after all. Scanned, I guess. All right, so that's all that done. You know what? Let's um, let's head to an... Why well, I'm not in combat. Let's go to another area on the planet. So I want to go to the day side. And this time I want to go to the wetlands again. So there we go, swamp. There we go. And it says 82% there. We'll go there. Hold on, chums. Now this said swamp. This does not look any different to where I was previously, does it really? I mean, some of the trees look a little bit different around here, but I, d I wouldn't say this was swampy or wetland or anything like, like you know. And I'm, I haven't seen any new fauna here at all in the time that I've been here, and I've been here a while. Let's... Hold on one second. What's that over there? Oh, no. Yeah, I've seen those before. Right, okay, let's um let's see if we can go further into that same biome. Okay, so maybe I wasn't deep enough in. Rocky desert. Swamp. Okay, that's 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 pretty darn So I want a big chunk of that light blue area. A big chunk of that light blue area. So I'm gonna go Well, it's probably the night side of the planet, but who's to say some of these creatures aren't nocturnal? I'm going to go there. At least it's 100% that biome. Okay, right. Here we go. This is looking a little bit better, isn't it? Even though it's, it's night time right now. Oh my god, there's a storm rolling in as well. That is kind of epic. At the same time, if I get into battle again with these things, it's going to be hard for me to tell the difference between what's an enemy and what's not, isn't it? Anyway, let's, let's carry on then. I want a point of interest to head to, really. we just head towards this structure. At least I've got a marker, because when it throws your camera angle around, it's hard to know which way you're actually supposed to be going again. And that's happening quite a lot to me on this planet. I don't know why, but on this planet it happens more so than any other. I suppose at least when it's dark, things are going to light up like freaking Christmas trees as well. So it might help me in finding what I'm after. But right now, not seeing anything completely. Look, see, there you go. That's just not my camera. And look, I'm going back towards my ship. So it's lucky that I had that point of interest. Hold on, there's another point of interest there. I haven't seen that one before. Life signs. Let's go towards that. Maybe that counts as a fauna. We will see. On oh, people, I'm seeing something blue. It doesn't look like a fauna, though. I don't know what that is. But it's blue, so I'm going to go scan it. What the fudge are they? What the actual fudge have I found? Oh, it's bone piles. Hold on, there is a, there is a fauna here. Oh, it's not a fauna. Please. Oh, for fudge's sake. Oh God, can you help me, please? Oh, I, I think... need to get to my ship. Oh no. I can't do it alone. We got attacked by some local predators. I've done this before. I managed to bunker down here, but now I've no way out. There's too many out there. I'll get mauled to pieces if I even try to make it alone. But right. You seem like I, I haven't got a many pack, so for a I can't help skin. you. I can't help you. I've not, I've not got any measurements. Your injuries would make this slow, but I'll cover you. Pass, not worth risking. Okay. Then let's do this. My ship's not too far from here. I'll mark it on your scanner, and we can book it together. All right. Come on then, buddy. Right. Okay, well, I was heading towards this life signs over here. Where's your poxy ship, mate? You haven't marked a ship on my... Right, we're going where I want to go first. If you die, you die. I don't really overly care. Dang it.
If he dies, he dies. Okay, let's keep going. I'll see you. Okay, well, we've arrived, Decated. It says that everything here has already been scanned, though. So, yeah, there is that. And I'm really not finding any other fauna that I haven't already scanned before, which is a little unusual. I've been running for a while now. Yeah, all scanned. Right, so what's over there? There's another life sign. So let's get this guy back to his poxy ship then. Right, where's your ship, mate? Not too sure where his ship is. Landing area. He hasn't marked anything on my map that I can see that's obvious anyway. Let's have a look at surface map. Let's see where his ship is. So I've just done that. Evacuate survivalist. Okay, so we need to go there. It's the one that... It's the marker that looks nothing like a ship. Of course. All right. Let's go there then. Okay, I'll let you know when we get there, people. Or if I find these missing faunas. Well, he's actually got a pretty nice freaking ship, has to be said. Okay, where's he gone? There he is. Let's go talk to him, man. You seem all right now, mate. You saved my life. Thank you so much. Not a problem, sir. You're welcome. Good luck with everything. It's harsh living off the grid. Without your help, I would have been a goner. Cool. You're most welcome. Well, that's enough adventure for one lifetime. Cool. Have fun. I mean, I could murder him and take his ship, I guess, but... Uh... Right, so there's a little outpost here. Not much to really have, I guess. Civilian outpost. Yeah, there's bits and bobs. There's... Okay, polymer five. Okay, fine. Hmm. So, I can't find this last remaining fauna for the life of me, people. Well, chums, look. It looks like I've spotted lakes. So, that's new. I'm just going to head on over and have a quick look to see what it is. I mean, it, it could just be some sort of weird reflection, but it does look like proper swampland is actually here. Or it could just be resources or something, or mist. Who knows? But I'm hoping to find new fauna around here. That's what I'm hoping, anyway. Actually, it looks like just the ground is shiny. It's a resource in the ground, isn't it? It's probably not swampland at all. Look, it's not even flat. It looked flat from up there. Ah, some biscuits. All right, I guess ignore me then. I'm going to carry on heading this way anyway, just in case. But I have seen no new blue fauna on this planet. I'm starting to wonder whether it might be glitched out or something. Or maybe my theory of caves was a good theory. But maybe I've got to find a cave inside of this biome, like over there. Got anything on your scanner? Yes, a cave, Sarah Morgan, a cave, just over there. But I, I'm kind of... I, I do want to see whether this is flat over here, because this is kind of where it looked like swampy land. Is this actually water? No, it's not. It's like a gravelly-type texture, isn't it? But it, it's still not swamp. It's weird that it calls this... It's weird that it calls this swamp. It looks nothing like a swamp. Anyway, we'll head towards that cave then, wherever that cave was. There it is over there. I'll head there. Okay, chums, I got attacked by the invisible creature again, and this time it killed me. I don't know when it last saved. Okay, chums, so there is wetlands. Okay, so I wasn't imagining things earlier. There's rocky desert. Swamp coast. Coast, you say, people. Okay. That's something I haven't seen. Coast. Okay, chums, well, it does look like there is oceans here. So maybe I might find the last two remaining fauna around here. So it just took a lot of clicking until I got to coast. And now I've found the coastline. Hopefully we're going to find the creatures that I have yet to have found. I keep hearing little tweet noises that I haven't heard anywhere else on the planet. So I'm wondering whether there might be another airborne fauna. But then again, you know, ground fauna could make tweeting noises. Who knows? The cactuses are here as well. So that's kind of good. 
Yeah, so it looks like you can find everything in these coastal areas, because I haven't seen something not here yet. Why does the camera keep doing that? Oh, that's so annoying. I was even in the air that time. I thought I got around that sort of issue by doing jumping all the time. Obviously not. I don't know what causes it to span her up like that, but it keeps doing it. It's This planet, although it's a beautiful... Look, there's loads of cactuses here. That's your best bet then. Head towards the coast for the cactuses, people. Because they are... I, I spent the most time looking for blinking cactuses. Hold on. We've got some blues. There's fish. There's freaking fish on this planet. Who would have Adam and Eve it? Look, there's there's like a, a mother and child one there. Or is that two different types? Pack sea hag and sunfish. There's two different types of fish. That's our last two fauna. So we're just going to run up the coast and try and find more of them. Well, I think we're nearly done. Chums. The water is extremely, extremely toxic. As soon as you go anywhere near the blinking stuff, look what happens, look. Look, caution, caution. Contamination. Don't swim. So you need to go near to the water, just don't go in it, people. Holy fudge, what was that? That was a freaking scary growl. Okay, we'll carry on along here. I've no idea what these fish look like. I know I keep saying it, but they need to add in some sort of creature compendium or co planet compendium to show you all the plants and all the creatures in here that you've found that would be a really welcome addition heck yes i'm i'm gonna make an ideas video and try and tag bethesda in it or something for ideas because that, that i think that definitely improve things okay well i've got three here oh look at that someone just um subscribed and a jacks thank you right there we go got that one got that one Right. Got that one. Need to get out of the water or else I'm going to die. Get out of the water. Right, okay, cool. Hopefully that environmental hazard is going to go down again. So we're doing okay on these. You may have noticed I moved my camera up a bit so you can actually see the scan results and stuff. There you go. There we go. There's one more there. 83%. Oh, we're getting so close to have got all these fish done. I have no idea what they look like. Oh, there's one more amongst them. Got him. I think we only need one more of each type now. There's one over there. That's 100% scanned on those ones. We just need one more of these big critters. All right. Okay. That's doable. We'll just carry on on the coast. Just one more. And we can get off this rock. Out of all the planets that I've done so far... This one and Parrot Nirai, or whatever it was, are the two that I haven't enjoyed. And this one I haven't enjoyed doing this one, mainly because the swamp has also said 80 odd percent. But I'd got everything in there. I've spent ages running around the swamps. I oh, don't crash. Hold on. I'm going to save. Because you may have seen that game stutter then as well. Now, the other things I don't like has been the amount of um, camera hiccups on this one. With it keep rotating the camera on me for no reason outside of my control. That I haven't enjoyed. That's been that's been tedious. Uh, finding the cactuses wasn't fun. I didn't. I've been trying to look to see if there was oceans and coast. It was only by sheer freaking chance that I found coast. Coastline on this planet is very hard to find, even though little swathes of freaking ocean here. Work that one out, people. So, yeah, that's why I haven't enjoyed this one as much as other planets. The wildlife here has been fairly cool, though. It's got it's got a good mixture of nasty creatures and docile creatures. But it's also got an invisible creature that seems to be able to attack me and I not be able to attack it. And it's killed me once. Another time it forced me back to my ship. Another time it kept me locked in combat for an inordinate amount of time. So... This planet, I feel, has been super buggy, and that's why I haven't enjoyed it all that much. Or, if it's not super buggy, and this is by design, then it's the worst freaking planet I've ever come across. Uh, I mean, admittedly, I haven't come across a lot of planets, have I? So, I know the fish that I'm looking for. It's the big sucker. But now I'm not finding any of the big ones. And I've only got one left to find. This just adds to the irksome of this planet. 
Well, welcome, people. It is that time for pictures. Heck yes. The moment you hate when you go to parents and they pull out a photo album. When you come along with a new missus or something. You know, a partner, whatever. Anyway, we got ourselves a sea bath there. Isn't he shiny? Glorious. Freaking awesome. I love the creature designs. And look at these guys. Predatory dog spiked cat things. Oh, you don't want to come across those, do you? Well, I did. And I took a photo. And we got this guy. Look, you can see his giant smile. <laughs> no. What a weird looking creature that is. Okay, oh, yeah, we got these trolobites. Yeah, we've seen these a few times. You know, they're on Crete and other planets. We'll scan those on a few planets. But then again, we've got these in our own oceans. And I came across this lovely thistle type plant. Looks very Scottish, I guess. I've seen this on a couple of planets now as well. And yes, lovely sort of rock formation, eh? Yes, there were cactuses near these, but I found an abundance of cactus near the coast, people. Head to the coast. The coast is probably the best bet for a lot of the creatures, fauna and finds on this planet. And yes, there's me by a glorious giant mountain. Thank you. Imagine if that was an anthill. Stuff of nightmares! Okay, part of me's wondering. You know the fish that I haven't scanned? It's called, it's, it's called the sunfish. It's night time. Could it be that it only comes out during the day? Um, that could be an observation worth having as an observation. So maybe I need to find coast, but in the daytime. I mean, I don't, not too sure what the date. Well, you can sort of see that the sun is going down right now. It's not fully down. And the actual day night cycle on this planet is extremely slow. So you know what? I'm going to find coast in the daytime. Let's see if that makes it any different. So here we go. Well, that looks like water there. Yeah, there's the ocean. Okay. So if I can go right on the coast. Swamp coast. There we go. And that's in the day. Okay, right. Well, I'm nearly at the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the sea. Here we go. We're here now. Let's have a look and see if we can find the last fisherman fish fish. The sun is in the sky. It's called a sunfish. Let's see if my theory has merit, which it probably doesn't. Okay. Now, I always tend to go north along here. Hold on. There we go. There it is. Sunfish scanned. So maybe that has got merit. Maybe maybe it only does appear. Health 50, ocean swamp, resource sealant, slightly skittish. Can I go into camera mode? Can I see what this fish Blenken looks like? Let's go and have a look at this fish. Okay, you can get quite a lot of loft on this camera, but not enough to see what it actually looks like. I'll get a bit closer, I suppose. Let's go into your camera mode. What the fudge are you doing, mate? You're not a fish. Right, let's go and have a better look. See if we can see what this fish... It's hard to say what that fish looks like. It's bizarre. All right, people. I think we're done. I think we've fully scanned this planet now, haven't we? Yes, we have. Awesome. Well, that didn't take freaking years. Yeah, being sarcastic, people. That was a freaking time and a half. Holy moly! Well, that was probably the most sort of... Oh, God, Sarah. That's that's a freaking good idea. Heck, yes, it is. Um, get up from the ship. Yep. God, that was, that was not fun. I did take a couple of photos, so hopefully you've already seen those people. But, yeah, that was pretty much that. You know what, Sarah? I think we're going to do a moon next episode. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's probably a good good bet. Uh, let's talk to my adoring fan. He always... Sorry, buddy. I'm going to be heading out with Sarah again this episode. We've got some dialogue choices with Sarah to, to go through. But you know what, people? I think that's enough for today. Take care. And thank you for watching. Hopefully, I've earned your subscription. Hopefully, that helps you fully cut along this planet quicker than I did. But that was painful, wasn't it? Until next time. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.